Hey, what's up, everybody? You are now tuned into T. T. And it's your girl, Jazzy J. N. My Diesel. Hey, and we in the building, y'all, man. Thank y'all so much to everybody that's been like, commenting, and subscribing. We appreciate y'all. Man, this is a video that we have for y'all. We know we late, but <laughs> we back, babe. What's this video? Man, this is the GoFundMe. Man, Grandmaster J. You know it's the donation time. Man, this is the video for Grandmaster J, y'all. He is still fighting these charges, y'all. We got to lock it down and make sure we do what we got to do. Um, us having experience in federal case, man, that's, it's not easy. Mm. And it costs a lot of money. So let's do everything we can to support him. Sorry that we are late on putting this out. We've been out of town, but we know our other peeps, Major TV, K Money, they all have been putting this out. So we just want to make sure we share and everybody get the word out to support Grandmaster J. Yeah, that's right. Man. All right, y'all. Uh, until the next one, we appreciate y'all and peace, fam. I guess by now, a lot of you are learning the hard way about the differences and the challenges that a person encounters when they become ensnared in the judicial system and they need adequate legal support. I want to spend a few minutes and talk about the differences in that litigation and who does it. For instance, if you're going to file a civil suit, you need a civil lawyer. If you're filing a criminal complaint, you'll need a, for fighting a criminal complaint, you'll need a criminal lawyer and so forth and so on. Different types of lawyers for different types of cases. There's a difference between state court and federal court, which means you need different types of lawyers who practice in each one of those places. State lawyers don't practice in federal court normally, and federal lawyers don't practice in state court because the rules and the operations are completely different. The state is based on money and the bail system. And of course, if you hire the right attorney and you pay him enough money, uh, nine times out of ten, you stand a very good chance of beating that particular case. At the federal level, it's a little different. The federal prosecutors and the federal defenders share equal power. They're both appointed by the president. So therefore, uh, you can go out and you can bring in someone if you want to, but they're not going to have any more power than the person that is actually empowered by the president to represent you. That being said, most people have experience with uh, state court not federal court. In my case, and in the instance of the Grand Master J Legal Defense Fund, I am fighting two cases at the same time in two different types of courts, which means I have two sets of lawyers, two sets of investigators, and two cases to beat. That being said, uh, there's a great deal of money that has to be paid at the state level, and then at the state and federal level, money has to be paid for the investigators to go out and create all of the evidence that counteracts the bogus charges that may be against me or the legitimate charges that may be against somebody else. None of this stuff is cheap and the courts are very expensive. Therefore, I want you to understand that I have a federal and a state case and I am the only person uh, that they're looking for to be able to not be able to meet these financial obligations because then I'll not be able to defend myself adequately. However, just as everyone learned in the case of O.J. Simpson uh, when he won his first case, it was because he had the money and the means and the right people to put together an adequate defense that resulted in his acquittal. In this particular instance, I'd like to ask everyone to please continue to support the Grand Master J Legal Defense Fund because obviously we're doing something right. They're still dragging it out because every time they think they have a case, we keep taking it apart. Every time they think they've got enough to go to trial, we come back and say, no, 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 wait a minute. We went out, we did this, we got that, and it doesn't make sense. And since it doesn't make sense and they don't want to drop it, then it just keeps going until the next round. Why are we doing this? Because we know that I am innocent. And it is only through your continued support of the Grand Master J Legal Defense Fund that I will eventually beat these charges and we can get back to the work that we had at hand of liberating and repatriating and reparating our own people. I ask you also, do not think that all cases are the same. They are not. Federal and state cases are completely different. The dynamics are different. The costs are different. Please continue to support me. We are already seven, eight months into this ordeal, and now it is time for us not to grow weary. It is now time for us to continue to keep them on the ropes, and I need your help more than ever. I bid you peace. 
I bid you shalom.